Eris, a top 11 player in the world, which probably puts him somewhere around top five, if not even better for North America. One's ladder. He's been asking me about trying to get into a show match as soon as possible. And he said, what's the best way to do it? I say the same thing to everybody. If you want to eventually play in a show match, the answer is always the same. The higher you get on the one's leaderboard, the more or the, the tougher it is to uh, not get you into a match because you're just proving that you deserve to go up against the best. And that is what Eris has done as he brought himself to number 11 in the world and wave dashes this. In fact, we've had a ton of Brazilian love in terms of the players in the show matches over the past couple weeks or so. So huge credit to them. Eris, nice pass to himself off the back wall. Maybe he had a bit of a better matchup against him than he does Yan. I don't have a ton of insight to their ranked games. We'll see how he can fare today. He seems to be doing well so far. Yan going the full distance, finishing with a bump, and certainly this can't be considered cringe. You know, I talked about an eligible bump that I think Yan got yesterday, and how it was way too mechanical to be... Yan is going to convert back corner boost. Air is going to be in a really tough position. He's passing the ball to Yan once again, but he does time his challenge well, even without any boost to work with. And a fast recovery might mean a lead for Eris. Yan is going to air dribble and reset. Jumps over the shadows. Yan's fake kickoff does get him a possession. Eris. Outplaying himself a little bit by flipping past the ball and goes to bump Yan again. Means he grabs the midfield boost. He's trying to control the ball and get Yan to back off because Yan is playing on just pads right now. And this was probably a bit of a mistake and that has to do with Yan's ball pressure. Eris felt like he needed to get up and make a play on the ball with Yan's fake challenge because Yan's done such a good job of constantly being on the ball on offense. This may be a different ending. Bump from Eris. Doesn't matter. He's oh wait! Maybe it does. Yan just hands the ball right to him. Session, an opportunity to tie the game and go to overtime. Air dribble bump. Yan is over the top of it. Not a bad idea by Eris. Just needed to get ahead of the ball quicker. He wanted to make sure he connected with Yan. Great save by Yan. 7-5. Eris had the early lead, but Yan gets gain number one. The best of five. They did not succeed. Eris had it all covered. Shadow pre-jump. Nice save by Eris. It's interesting watching it from his perspective. Saw him put himself out of the play with the shadow pre-jump earlier. This time, able to play this over the top of Yan. Yan does get a touch, though. It comes off with a blue trail. He's going to try an immediate shot, and that'll be a goal for Yan. It was going to be tough, even if he got a connection on it. There was not a second reset, which makes... Yan's opportunities far more limited. Eris backing off the ball as he directly shadows Yan. Delayed flick and it's past Eris. Who I believe is pre-jumping for earlier movement on the play. Oh my goodness. Just Kickoff win. Time to stop the bleeding for Eris. And he does. 72 is kind of like what I get in, at Arizona. Depending on what server you get. So there's a chance he's not fully West Coast. That's going to be in though. 5-1 for Yan. Big kickoff to the back corner. Yan going to try and go the full distance again. And he does successfully. 6-1. Yan has started his freestyle arc here. The ball did not drop from ceiling heights. Eris going to have... An opportunity for a solid possession here. But seems to be playing too quickly. He was playing so confident before. That come almost like panic jumps. That's a great flick in terms of power, but placed slightly wide. Yan is going to go air dribble bump. No reason not to from this position. Time to grab some boost. Eris off the wall. Yan falls from the ceiling back down to the ground. And Eris is dribble. Yan, tight angle flick. Yan off the sidewall, the reset, and catches it to pop it past Eris. You have to try and find a way to defend Yan's air dribbles. 
And it, because he's so fast in the midfield, he always finds a way to get himself some space. Right now, he's truly freestyling if he goes for another reset. But he's not able to get back on the ball. And it will be an Eris goal. Minutes and eight seconds to work with. Without Eris reading that. Likely to waste a ton of time. But as I say that, Eris backflip challenges. Eris trying to low 50 this challenge. Does not succeed in doing so. And a uh, another player that was at LAN. Yeah, and my goodness, dude. <laughs> He's found his zone here. And he can do this to people. He can absolutely become unstoppable. Harris pre-jumped and went high, but not high enough. Yan goes all the way to the ceiling. I'm going to change his car, BRB. Okay, we're actually able to... Uh, we'll let Yan free play. I don't know if Harris knows that I can end the games early if he wants to. Oh, let's go. Didn't hit the ground. Ooh, Eris' new car already looking good. Game number two going to Yan. Can Eris turn it around? And that has gone in favor of Eris when Yan has matched him, though. He's been able to erase that advantage. Yan, what a shot. I, I, I Only because I saw it happen yesterday when we had Yan versus apparently Jack. Do I know it's possible to defend against Yan? Oh. Doesn't get the demo on the first swing by, but turns around, gets him on the follow-up, and Eris, no! It needed a vehicle so bad, and he knows it. Not the kind of misses that you could get away with against Yan, and now he's just going to go get as many resets as possible. Okay, he gave it back to you. <laughs> he gave it back to you, so that's good. <laughs> Eris likes his chances in a tie game in overtime. So he is going to slowly let this one go in. Only 12 boosts to work with. He's going to have to defend yet another one of these dribbles. And I wanted to watch this one from Yan's perspective. Because, or sorry, from, from Eris' perspective. Because this is, it just felt like there's absolutely nothing he could do. Once Yan was past him, now he will go up to the ball at maximum heights. Where just he should be able to reach it. He cannot force it in. So Yan lives to see another day. In defense, and he's just too quick, man. <laughs> now we're doing a bit here with Eris and yeah, nice double though. Great 50. Starting this dribble from the ceiling, gonna land far away from the net. Actually goes for the ground double. Can he carry it? And bump! Eris, what a shot! Yan throws him the nice one, and it's very much deserved. Eris all the way from the back corner. Able to finish it off. I know he has it in him. He ties the game with that shot and might even take the lead. 4-3. Can't wait to steal it. Next time I'm watching someone else's show match and a shot like that is hit. Eris letting this one in. Get out. a shot attempt. He's going to come off the ceiling and take the ball away. Ooh, he just needed to bounce to hit a little bit more on the corner and it would have been an easier tap in. He tried to make it work with what he was given and now it's just going to be a Yan goal. That's got to hurt. And reset over the top of Eris. Can get around the ball and get the angle. What a save. Can Eris follow it up? He can. He's only down two with a minute left to go. But when Yen has the ball, Eris has had such a tough time getting it from him. And Yen always seems to be able to eventually convert. Oh, Eris. He's going to want that one back. A couple different moments that have been the difference here between Eris bringing back the match. And uh, Yan being able to take mentioned he didn't have a great matchup against Yan in ranks compared to some other top 1v1ers. And that, unfortunately for him, has looked to carry over in to the show match. But Eris played well. I think we're going to try and get Eris in against some other players. Oh my goodness, Yan. <laughs> Yan wants to go out in style. He doesn't want the show match to just end without a bang. Oh my goodness, dude. <laughs> GG's. Thanks for playing. Always great having Yan on, man.